Hello there and welcome back to House Flipper and welcome back to the Pitch Perfect Apartment. You'll remember this place, it was lovely lovely. Uh, you'll remember that we did this floor in the last video. And we made it look all beautiful, put him in a very nice kitchen and it was all fantastic. Now it did say in the opening to this one that I am 48% done. On this apartment and you can see that we're still not at the even minimum done on this apartment so I'm taking it that the top floor is going to be the one that has all the inspirations on it because we haven't seen any of those as of yet now this is going to be the last video on this apartment so let's go up to the top floor and see just how bad it really is because we know obviously that there is four rooms up here to do so what I'm gonna do is I'll show you around the rooms and what they look like right now this is one of the rooms and then we'll go through here this is the other room which is the bathroom or what was a bathroom uh, then we have this room right here. Lovely jublet, horrible wallpaper. Looks like my nan put it up back in 1943. And then obviously we have this room as well. So what I am going to do right now is I'm going to literally clean everywhere on this floor. In the bathroom I'm going to take down the walls because... Um, these middle pillars need taking down and stuff like that so I'm gonna sell everything take everything down and then I will get back to you guys uh, after I've done that oh this is a big job let's go okay so we have cleaned up all of the areas and I've also done the walls and the painting in all the areas because that's just kind of a standard thing with house flipper there's no need to drag you through all of that and you know what i'm gonna paint it and stuff this place basically it wanted to be white we sold everything that we had to sell and we put on some new doors you can see it's nice and bright and light um then we come into this room now this was the only room that actually had um any form of sort of two tunnel thing I put a light in here actually um, and it was white and blue I didn't like the connection of white and blue so um, it gave me the option to either just it was basically a 100% paint in white and blue and what you can actually do with that is you can choose which colour you paint it in so you can do a completely blue one if you want to do and that's what basically I did. I did it all in blue. So that's what this room's been done as. We haven't put any furniture in or anything quite yet. And we've got this room, which is in blood red. Um, this was basically just asked to colour it in blood red. Go, it is coloured in blood red. This is the little bathroom where it had all the little stalls in and everything like that now there's a little door in here because it asked me to put it in uh, these were in the original bathroom uh, beforehand and basically just put in a shower thing put up all the tiles it was all one tile didn't ask for two so all one tile and then we come into the end room which is now connected via the bathroom as well but the end room is just literally all painted in white as well as requested with this um, white and herring wallpaper at the end. Now it did say 15 pieces and there's nowhere really that does 15 pieces in here so I, I had to stick one there. I hate it but fuck them. So what we're going to do is we're going to start out with this room, we're going to decorate up all of the rooms and everything like that. I haven't seen any room with inspiration things in it yet, but 
maybe that'll come in a little bit later on when we've put in some of the stuff. So let's put in the things that they want in here. Uh, I think we should probably keep everything quite light, quite basic, because it is, I mean, it is a light bedroom for sake, so we'll keep everything quite light and basic in here. Uh, there's the bed. And we need a queef nightstand, which is this one. We can do it in Grey Beach, actually, just to give it a little bit of a... An edge, that is. Bigger than I thought it was going to be. That's what she said! Sorry, I had to. So we'll do that. Move the bed across just a little bit. So we can hopefully get a nightstand in the side. Still walk around it, which is good. Yep. <coughs> and then we need to get a desk in here. Poof. A poof. We need one of them. Not oh, actually sure. Okay. Odd. Ah, we need a bathroom door in here as well. So do all of that exactly the same as what we did for the actual outside bathroom door. Difference between this one is it's a narrow one, so it actually only takes three spaces, not the uh, four spaces that the normal doors take. So let's pop that in there. Like that. We've actually reached the point now of the half of the halfway. We can leave the job if we wanted to. We're not gonna, obviously. That's just dumb. Why would we do that? I like that. And we'll do the light coloured handles so it matches the um dresser. The, the nightstand at the other side. Pop in that. A ceiling like triple. What's this? Oh, it's carpet. That makes sense. So I think what you. Yeah. Let's put that there. Put like that. Put that round. Just to look out the window, I don't know. Who the hell knows? This is a ceiling lamp triple. Do this in white as well. That. Juggly stuff. And then we have Mirror to put up as well. Which can fit that. And then obviously we have two table lamps to put up. Like that. Down, so go to bed. I like that. So it relatively goes through the bed. That is this room done and dusted. Beautiful stuff. That actually should have probably been grey more than anything else. Just pop that back in again. It's costing them money, but hey ho, there we go. It'll be fine. Grey beach. Same as everything else. So it looks right. There we go. Brilliant stuff. Um, so yeah, this is the bedroom. Let's move across now to the bathroom. All it asked me to put in here was a shower. It didn't ask me to put a toilet in here. A little bit odd, but hey ho, there we go. Because I don't. Was the toilet downstairs still? Open the toilet downstairs still. 
Ah, a left side shower. Okay, I've got to hope. There we go, it does. I was hoping that it'd go right across. There we go. Pop that in. Shower. Stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. So, we've got a light called mirror. Here as well. Which can go... Obviously, there's two of them, so they'll be both. Sink. Not directly in the middle. Obviously, because... You know, I never do things directly in the middle. These days, it would appear. So, we have a tube shot ceiling lamp to put in. Like these. It's going to be a really dark bathroom, but yeah. Oh, we have two of them. Would make more sense, wouldn't it? Put the other one there. And then we have the sconce lamps as well. Which of course we'll put over the top of the mirrors. Not so sure about the fact you'll have to go downstairs to have a pee, but you know. Maybe that's the way he likes to do things in his house. So two towels. Try and keep everything some form of order of colour. There we are. And then we have a jana round carpet. Start blue works okay, actually I think this one. Put a medium one in. And there you go. Bathroom is now done. Still very odd that they don't have a toilet in there, but hey ho. Okay, so let's then go into this room. I don't think there's a lot that's needed in this room. A couple of computers, things like that. So we need an armchair. Now, this room is actually quite... It's dark on the walls, things like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to also make the furniture. Probably the same as well. Just to... Oops, it is. I didn't want to do that. Yep. Then we have a computer to put in. Put it on the red computer because it would have probably fit with the walls and everything like that. So I'll cut my budget will run out soon. It's not my fucking budget, it is. He should have given me more bloody money. <laughs> Sleep. Keyboard as well. Straight up this normal keyboard here. Like that. And then we need a maple mouse. Or a maple mouse, I should say, because it sounds a little bit too much like um, an actual company. You can see here that you can turn all the lights on on everything. Let me. Nope, I don't want to do that. Move the chair around a little bit. And it looks good. So, we have uh, a few paintings to put up. So we'll just put up medium ones, uh, because all of this wall is obviously available to us <coughs> to put up four pictures. 
I think the ship is the same size. Hopefully. I can't actually see putting them at the right height. There we go. We've got more to put up. Uh, two more to put up, sorry, I do apologise. Basically, do it like that, and then put one painting on the wall because it's a little bit different anyway. So we can put that there. Uh, guitar there. Pop the painting. Like that. Good stuff. So, this room is now done as well. Very, very quick off the mark. Don't you just love it? Yep, I do as well. Uh, oh, this looks like it's going to be a kid's room. It is going to be a kid's room. But, how many of these do we need? Okay, I might leave that one for a little bit. I don't know how many of them. Oh, we need eight of them. Well, it is a bit of a blue room, so we might as well as make it a blue blue space. I don't think it's going to fit in there. No, it's not. So let's do that. Multi level bookcase. Which we could probably put these actually in this corner. Like that. And then we've got a mini Lightclub bookcase. I, I wasn't expecting it to be a kid's room. I, I'll be frankly honest, I wasn't expecting that to, uh, to happen, but. Hey, stranger stuff has happened. I mean, we did a Fifty Shades of Grey video, so, you know, on House Flipper. I mean, what can you expect from this game now, you know? What else have we got left? Table in there, and we need a light coloured chair. Two of these chairs, actually. I don't really need to put it underneath, but I do because, you know, people get all... Go! We need an epi... what? Why would you put a... Why would you put a plant in a kid's room? I mean, that's, that's just a bit weird to me. Although it does seem like it's a bit more of a... Well, I was about to say that it seemed a little bit more like it was an older kid's room, but with a rocking horse like this, it been ain't. That is odd. Okay, pass, uh, basket with a basket of theme. Oh, what? What? Right. What are these for your laundry? Sky round carpet. Put a medium one in here. And then we have the some wall stars. Eight. Bad boys, we'll do them in large. 
Hey, these bad boys. Intel, let's go. Let's do. Oh. Five. X. Seven. Eight. That's probably the best I've actually ever done anything. Should have been a little bit further over in the wall, but you know. So everything is now done and dusted. We have this lovely little room up here. So let's go quick walk around the house. You are going to see the before and after shots uh, in a minute anyway. So we'll just have a quick walk around the house for the stuff that we've done. Lovely little kind of office space right there. We then have the bathroom right here, which doesn't have a toilet in. That's still getting me a little bit. I mean, for five grand, I could probably put in a toilet in there. But yep, yeah. uh, that's the bedroom area, and then we go obviously downstairs to the first floor, which is the kitchen area down here, and the jubbly, because the kids are gonna have to come as well to go to the loo, which is odd. And then obviously we have the downstairs where we did the uh, couch there and the piano. And yes, we have the toilet here. No, shower. You know what? Just just because it's bugging me so much, and I do have 5,135 of the budget left, it's, it's just bugging me. I can't help it. I really want to help it, but I can't, you know? Store. Installations. Let's do a suspended toilet plumbing system. Like that. Then let's go with you. Bathroom fixtures. We need a suspended toilet now. Toilets. There we go. Best suspended toilet. Thank you very much indeed. Like that. Okay. There we go. I don't know, it was, it was just really odd that it wasn't there. I like them stars. Um, it's just really odd. So yeah, anyway. This is that, and then this is the downstairs. So what we're going to do now is we're going to end the job. You'll get to see a couple of the before and after shots and everything like that. Job is done. We're going to make $21,708.12 pence from this one and we've left him with four grand after we've done it as well 100% of the job let's go So that was a pretty nice job for all. I actually quite enjoyed doing that job. You know, it was a little bit strange, don't get me wrong. Yeah. So, you know, it's all good. But, 
Thank you very much indeed for watching. If you do enjoy the House Flipper content, hit me up with a like because, again, it helps all the YouTube algorithms and everything like that. Um, if you do find yourself coming back here on the regular, why not hit me up with a subscribe? You can uh, also let me know that you're not happy with House Flipper content by clicking the dislike button. YouTube won't show everyone else, but it will show me. Um, that maybe this is not kind of the thing. Do you have any changes that you want to make? You want me to do more, do less, do, you know, this, that, and the other? Um, short videos, longer videos? Let me know in the comment section down below. This, this series, this channel, everything, it only works if you guys interact and stuff like that. So please, you know, any comments, any suggestions, let me know in the comment section down below. But for right now, that is it. I'm out of here, and I will see you all in the very next video with whatever I decide to post. Bye bye.